It's official. I'm holding the L. Now what do I mean by that? I mean I am going to play this game. Now what is this game? It is Infinite Warfare. Kind of forgot to turn down the game volume at first, but I, I'm going to hold the L. As in, I'm going to grind this game for multiple reasons. Now one reason is that I want to get into competitive Call of Duty. And a lot of the, this year's competitive players don't really like this Call of Duty. Now I'm complete booty cheeks at it right now. My first game I went 45 and 6 or something like that. But I'm still trying to get used to everything. I'm playing with newer sensitivities because I went to playing on a really low sensitivity at first. And um, yeah, why am I doing this? Because I want to be in the competitive scene and it just seems like a lot of competitive players don't want to play this game they don't like it all the big youtubers they don't like it but they have to play it because they're on the team another reason is is that i've been playing cod 4 for years i just picked it up again on the 360 before they even announced the cod 4 remaster so i've been playing cod 4 for a long time now yes i will take call of duty 4 over infinite warfare over this futuristic bullcrap every day but i just need something new i've been playing cod 4 for years the game's been out for 10 years now or i think some it's next year it comes out it's been out for 10 years because it was 2007 been out for damn near 10 years though and I just need something fresh and I'm willing to grind out on this game because why I'm still in high school I don't have a job I don't even have a car I don't even have my license I'm 15 and I know what's possible for 15 year olds to play Call of Duty competitively because of the homie Sharp now, if you don't know who Sharp TK is I highly recommend checking him out but his first tournament I believe he said was when he was at the age of 15, he did his first Call of Duty tourney, and he's, look at where he's at today, he's pretty well off for himself. Another thing is, is that I'm very adaptable. The reason why I'm getting absolutely slammed in this map, and in this game, is because I'm not used to it. I've played like three games in total on it, and... I'm willing to hit the grind squad and actually start streaming and everything and so I need to your guys' opinion. Do you think if I actually try my best um, I can go competitive because you guys have seen some of my better gameplays um, but I usually like if you want to go back on some of my awesome Black Ops 3 games like some of the good ones I've had. I, I've only posted a few good ones on YouTube. Reason for that being is that for some reason every time I press the record button and I did a lot of live comms and I still do, I would always do complete trash. But I had a lot of really good off camera games. I mean a lot. I believe my best scoring game ever was 204 on Domination. I absolutely tore him up with a VMP and scavenger. So I say I'm half decent at these futuristic Call of Duties. And also it's time for the pro players to get a break, maybe even take a year off. I can be, I'm fine with being a complete substitute player and uh, only being there every now and then, you know, maybe just for this Call of Duty or for the next one when the actual roster needs a break. But what I want to do with my life is I want to play video games and I want to play Call of Duty because I am a Call of Duty fanboy at heart. I've never really wanted to admit it until recently when I've realized yes that is true. I love Call of Duty just as much as the next guy. I'm in high school it's the best game just to sit down and play but I'm definitely down to play other games. Don't think this is a complete devotion to only this game. But basically what I'm saying is that I'm going to be posting this a lot more. Because to grind the competitive scene, I also need to get my name out there and grind the YouTube scene. So if you guys know anybody you can even possibly a semi-minute chance to get in contact with and let them know if they're looking for a new player, that I'm out. And I'm actually going to be trying really hard and hitting some clips and you know montages montages will be a thing again I used to do little really crappy mini tages some of them only having one kill in each clip and it would be always within the same game I would literally record like 20 minutes and then go and make a montage but this time I'm actually dedicated to start trying I am willing to grind I'm willing to do this for you guys depending on what you want to see and this is where you guys dictate my channel now how do you guys dictate my channel that is completely up to you like whether you actually want to see this or not 
and you just have to tell me in the comment section below, would you like to see me grinding out on the Call of Duties? I'm down for it because I love Call of Duty. No matter what, you're going to be getting Call of Duty content, just whether how much of it. Yeah, guys, it's always been a pleasure, and I hope you all enjoyed this video. Again, let me know in the comment section below. It's time to hit something. I need change. And again, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Definitely drop a like on the video if you enjoyed. And if you're new here, feel free to subscribe and check out my channel. But if you don't like my content, don't feel obligated to subscribe or anything like you probably have already clicked off by now. But anyway, guys, I hope you all have a good day and stay frosty, my friends.